Good morning, good morning, good morning to the internet. After looking at all the footage from yesterday and like editing yesterday's vlog, I was like, man, this place is super cool. It was just like, oh, all these weird circumstances yesterday. I felt so bad because he like was so excited about giving me a Christmas wonderland and it didn't happen till later that night. But anyway, talking about you. I had a massive pimple on my face and you didn't even tell me about it. I didn't see it. Anyway, now we're gonna go walk around a little bit and then we're gonna drive home. What were you saying about me out there on the balcony? I was saying that you were really sweet to bring me here. And this place is really cool and it sucked that when we got here, the circumstances weren't perfect and pretty and... Yeah, I had a movie in my head of how I was gonna pull up and everything was gonna be lights and Christmas throwing up in your face and it was an old people's home, so... I loved it. It made for the best vlog of the month, that's for sure. Josh and I are getting pie and coffee. Pie, coffee, pie. Technically, it's a cappuccino, and cappuccino is not really classified, it's just not really coffee. What? I only like cappuccinos in Australia because they have chocolate on them. Okay, I am back in North Hollywood. I'm at my apartment. I don't know what I'm what am I doing? Why do I why am I talking like this? I'm gonna have a night in. I'm already in my onesie. And uh, Corey and I are gonna have a night in and just eat some food. And I am way behind on fan mail. Like I respond to every single person individually that writes to me. So this is only some of my fan mail. That's a phone. But these are all binders full of letters. And that's only a couple months worth. And I need to write people back who wrote me this summer. So I'm like crazy behind. So I need a night to get up, caught up and write everyone back who wrote to me because it's very rude to not write people back who write you a letter. Oh my gosh, I'm going through fan mail, it's late. But look what someone made me. This is a Miranda $500 bill, which is the coolest thing ever. I love this. A girl from Spain painted this and it's amazing. There's just so many cool pictures and and little gifts and stuff so thank you if you've written me in the last six months i'm working on writing you back it might take me a little bit but i'm getting there also corey just filmed the video um you guys should subscribe to him if you haven't yet because i'm forcing him to make more videos now and he's the funniest person i've ever known in my life and right now he's uploading or he's editing a video about christmas pickup lines so you guys should check it out all righty i'm gonna go okay um this is probably going to be really shaky because I'm shaking profusely. See these cop car cars? My sister just got in a car accident. Her car flipped and I'm actually sh my pants. I'm waiting for the cops to let me see her. She's okay, but I'm about to have a heart attack. Rachel's alive! I don't know how because... Oh, you can't even see. That's... My car's in a ditch. like this and people are dead and somehow she's alive and Rachel's super lucky that she doesn't have a scratch on her I'm sure she'll be sore tomorrow but um, I cannot believe she got out of that go hug your family I am like freaking out Rachel's all fine she's like what's up come here give me a hug you seem stressed and I'm like crying and she's totally fine she's such a badass so Rachel, yeah, what happened? I was driving and then a car swerved into me and then I overcorrected and spun out of control. And then what happened? I went in the car and I was like, I'm flipping, oh my God, I'm in an action movie. And then a bunch of water hit my face and went, oh my gosh, I'm in a river. And then I was like, oh, that's my coffee. And then uh, my car stopped and I was like, okay, it's done. So I put the car in park and I turned off the car because I saw that in a commercial once. And then I grabbed my phone because I was like, I need to call 911. And then I realized that my seatbelt was really hurting my abdominal area where I got my appendix taken out. So I took off my seatbelt, looked up, saw that the sunroof had been smashed and wasn't there anymore. So I crawled out of that 
and I ran up the dirt hill and there was a man that was like, are you okay? And then he called 911 and now we're here. <laughs> Badass of the century. Where's the dirt So, um, Rachel's gonna be asking for a new car for Christmas because she does not have one anymore. Holy shit. Oh my God, guys. Be safe, drive safe. Love your families, you never know what's gonna happen. And I love you guys. Oh my God. All right, I'm going to go hug my sister some more. Goodbye. Christmas light. Beautiful Christmas girlfriend.